Hello, this is Buona from Buona.tv and uh, I'm going to talk a little bit more about the iPhone. And uh, what I'm going to talk about is an application called iToner. Now up till now, we've been, uh, there have been a lot of different ways to put ringtones on your iPhone. Um, most notably there's the AppTap installer, there's uh, iBricker, uh, there's iFantastic, there's all these different ways where you can put SSH daemons SSH daemons on your iPhone and FTP over files. Now today Ambrosia Software released iToner. iToner is this application here which uh, simply has a little icon there and uh, at the moment it says no phone found. That's because I unplugged my iPhone. You know just to make sure that this is uh, going to work. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a, a trial run here. Uh, this is the trial software I downloaded and I'm gonna see if it works. I'm gonna plug it into my dock here. Okay, and then once I did that, of course I photo launches because I have camera pictures. Uh, let me close that. But this interface in iToner has changed. It now says drag ringtone sound files here. Alright, I'll do that. So I have over here Pathfinder which has my media folder. Um, let's see, I have a few files here. You probably can't read them. I'd be surprised if you could. But I'm going to get one called uh, Spotty Horn. That's one of my favorites. It's from the Outcast song Spotty Dopalicious. Uh, I'm going to play a little, little part of it here. Just a second. Oh, that's very loud. Sorry about your ears. Let's try it again. So that's one of my favorite ringtones. So I'm going to take spottyhorn.mp3 and I'm going to drag that, see I'm dragging, drag that to iToner over here. Okay, and now it's telling me click then here, click the sync button to update your iPhone. Um, there's an advanced button up here at the top, but I'm just going to do sync, see what happens. And it says wait you may now continue you wouldn't have to wait if you registered <laughs> okay so there's a little nag message here telling me to register so I'll say not yet because I'm just trying it out and it says sync in progress on my iPhone gosh that was fast it went away fast and I think it's done so now let's check out the iPhone and see if it actually worked so I'm going to go into my settings here. If I can tap it. And then I'm going to go to sounds. Let's see if I see spotty horn in my ringtones. Oh, there it is. Spotty horn. Now that was just too easy, wasn't it? You think it's worth 15 bucks? I don't know. Personally, I think I might stick with my uh, my old solution of just putting an SSH daemon and then uh, just uh, FTPing the files over which is essentially another drag and drop if I use Cyberduck or Transmit or anything like that. Alright, so that was kind of cool. This is Buona.tv showing you iToner. Uh, that was my learning experience and I hope you learned something from it. And I'll put the link in the, uh, in the notes of this show so you can download it and try it yourself. Toodles!